You are now 7 degrees north. Thank you for stopping by. Please add, share, like, comment, and subscribe. This woman's COVID vaccine side effect led to a stage 2 breast cancer diagnosis. A woman in Iowa is speaking out about an unexpected benefit of the COVID-19 vaccine. Getting the shot resulted in a stage 2 breast cancer diagnosis. Jennifer Mosley told the Des Moines Register that she noticed a swollen lymph node in her arm two days after receiving her second dose of the Pfizer vaccine in April. But because the swollen lymph node was in the same area where she had the vaccine, she didn't think much about it. Two days later, the lymph node was still tender. Mosley, who has a family history of breast cancer, realized she hadn't done a breast self-exam in a while. When she did the self-exam, she found a lump the size of a flattened grape on her right breast. Mosley made an appointment with her doctor to get the lump checked out, which led to a mammogram and a biopsy. Finally, in mid-May, she received a diagnosis. She had stage 2A invasive lobular carcinoma breast cancer, the same cancer that killed her cousin at age 38. Swollen lymph nodes can be a sign of the COVID-19 vaccine and types of vaccines. Infectious disease expert Amesh A. Adaja, MD senior scholar at the John Hopkins Center for Health Security in Maryland, tells Health, lymph nodes are part of your Im immune system and they can be activated and swell when you're exposed to something like a vaccine, he explains. Mosley's vaccine didn't cause the lump in her breast. It started a train of thought that motivated her to check herself for signs of cancer. This, Dr. Adaja points out, was a good coincidence. Mosley noted that she had a routine mammogram scheduled in July, but if she hadn't been vaccinated in April and discovered the swollen lymph node, her cancer could have grown before it was detected. The COVID-19 shot, I'm going to say as much as a COVID sucked, it saved me, she told the Des Moines Register. Mosley had a double mastectomy and breast reconstruction in mid-June and is now recovering. Her doctors think they removed all of the cancer and her family is hopeful that she won't need to undergo chemotherapy. Mosley is now encouraging people to check their breasts regularly. Everyone should be aware that they need to examine their breasts more often, she said. Before you go, please subscribe, share, comment, and turn on your notification bells. Thank you.